All right, guys. This is Josh here at Iron Hat Academy with our beautiful logo here. I'm here with Andrew, and I'm going to be showing you a takedown that you can use if you're in a clinch position. So we're going to start off in our clinch position. Now, everybody's seen stuff like this where guys get here and they end up hugging each other. Oh, and they both fall down and everybody's out and it's terrible, right? It, you know, in, in bow hurts or armored combat, you know, whether you win the takedown or not, if you hit the ground, you're out. So you don't want that to happen. So we've got an option for this clinch position here. So we're in this clinch position. I'm going to lower my center of gravity, so stay strong on this. And it's going to make him heavier on his feet. As I lower my center of gravity, I'm pulling down on him. His feet get a little bit heavier, it gets a little bit harder for him to move his feet. Now I'm going to take my outside leg here and I'm going to step outside of him. That puts even more pressure on that foot and makes it even harder for him to pull that foot out. Now I'm going to take my inside leg, I'm going to step around his hip. Now I'm going to hip in. As I hip in, he is going to completely break his posture. And he's going to fall down. And I'm still up, I'm never in a bad position, I'm never off balance. Right? So one more time, a little bit quicker. We're here, I lower my center of gravity, I step outside, I step inside, I hip in, I take him down. Boom. One more time at full speed, not actual full speed, but fuller speed, right? Center of gravity, step, hip in, down. All right, you're never in any danger if you do it right. That's it, you know, you don't want to hit the ground too, so Always stay in posture, never let yourself get out of your posture. Step around, step in, hip in. It's the hip in that really kills them. All right, this has been Josh at Ironhide Academy. Thank you, Andrew. Everybody have a great day.